1993, a French man named Emile Leray, then a 43-year-old former electrician, found himself stuck in a Moroccan desert near a city called Tantan after hitting his Citroën 2CV on a big rock, destroying the front axle and the chassis. Leray found himself stuck in the desert in a life-or-death situation. But the engineer came up with an idea, he was going to transform his wrecked car into a motorbike. He started by removing the body of the car and using it as a shelter. He then took three of the wheels of the vehicle and placed them on his new invention. Then he shortened the frame and fixed the axles. Next, he converted the car's rear bumper into a seat and put the engine in front of it. Then placed the suspension on the rear wheel and rigged the ignition to the handlebar so it functioned like a real motorbike. It took Leray 12 days and 11 nights to complete his invention, which proved a success and Leray was able to drive all the way back to France. On the way to Tantan, Leray was stopped by the police and given a 450 euro fine because the car registration documents did not match his vehicle.